and show you how I get this fox eye look. It's best if you wear a wig because people really think that, you know, you're foreign. Okay, so for this video, you are going to need your Q-tips, you're gonna need your alcohol, rubbing alcohol, and of course, um, the shape tapes. Shape tape? No, shape tape is something else. I love tape. Okay, so with the I love tape, I got, um, actually here's one unopened. So I got this on Amazon. I think it was like $17 and I got the one for dark hair. So it comes with the dark brown clips, but in the back, as you can see, like it comes with these and then it comes with the little tape thingies. And it comes with like an extra one just in case it breaks. Okay, so what you're gonna do is, so basically um, for my makeup, I just did a minimal makeup look just so I can show you how to put them on with makeup. Because if you're doing it on bare skin, all you gotta do is put the alcohol and just tug at it. So I will be putting a wig on because um, like I usually wear my wigs with this. And um, unfortunately I do not have my wig cap. I don't know where it's at, I can't find it. And I don't have another one. So I would put on the tapes, well I would put on the wig cap first and then I would put the tape on and then I will put my wig on. But I guess I'm just gonna show you without the wig cap. So first what you wanna do before anything is like figure out how you want your eyes to look. So this part of my eyebrow is completely filled in. So that's fake right there. So on this side, this is all my eyebrow. And then I'd have to like kind of go like that way to kind of like match it up so basically it's going to look like you have um a fox eye lift or a pdl thread lift and i kind of want it to be straight like that that's like my ideal look so i basically be putting the tape right here by the tail and going like that i'm basically just going to take some of the alcohol right where you measured it is kind of like where you're gonna put the tapes. So I'm gonna put this, basically the end of this tail part and I go as closest to the eyebrow as I possibly can. My tapes last all day. Um, maybe people are doing different methods and I wear my tapes for a very long time. I don't just wear it for two to three hours. Like I wear them like for six, seven hours and they last all day. So when you put them on, you want to make sure this is just lined up with that side so it's not in the tape part. Okay, so as close to the eyebrow as you possibly can. You really want to press that sucker in. There we go. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do the other side. Okay. So I clearly went too far up. I screwed up because I it was supposed to be here. Remember I did right there. And of course I put the tape right by my arch. So it's not really going to be a fox eye lift. Not so much as this one. This one is more of an eyebrow lift. And then let's just continue. So these things clearly hook into these. So what you're gonna do is make sure everything's all good. Now, I don't do it on the last, I do it on like the first two. If I really wanna pull, I'll put it on these two. Okay, you got some pretty lifted brows, although this is not how I usually do it. I clearly didn't measure it the way that I want. So now I'm just gonna show you how I put on my wig. It's completely secured in the back. It's kind of like a headband, basically. It's not uncomfortable. Like, I don't I don't care. It's not uncomfortable for me. 
It's like, do you want to look good or no? That's it. So I'm going to put on my wig for anybody that watches my wig reviews knows that Beauty Forever wigs are like the best wigs ever. And honestly, if you ask me, ooh. Oh, no. No. What you mean? Oh, so, um, this is what, the, excuse me. This is what the um, tapes look like. I feel like I look regular, but it's pulling on some things. But if I'm just gonna like spruce up this makeup look, I um, go in with my Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Medium, which is like the best thing since sliced bread is what is going on today? Anyways, it's the best thing since sliced bread. So I'm just gonna like put some on. Also, since I'm here, I, I did get this blush. I wanted to try it. It's by NYX and it's called Pinched. So I'm just gonna see how pinched I look. It's such a pretty shade. I think this is so cute. It almost matches my lips a little bit. So I'm going to take my brush. It just came in a nail to the eye. Okay. Oh, that's cute. She's cute. It's coming up way more in this mirror than on camera. And, you know, some people like to do that little that look that just it honestly gives people like a sun kiss type of vibe okay guys so this is what my tapes look like um they're pretty cute look and oh, okay my baby ears are lifting it's because i didn't lay this wig i'm literally just like pressing that baby hair it's just like it just hold it down stay so if you want an instant facelift go purchase these um on amazon i think it's like 17 dollars 17.98 18 dollars basically and you know if you can't afford the 800 dollars pdo thread lifts then you can get this for 17 dollars i would recommend that you get two face tapes for your chin as well now when i'm looking at people obviously my face looks pretty like I'd say it's an okay jawline we got going on, but men, I do not need to turn to the side. That will be a nightmare. So, oh, maybe I can get those face tapes to do like this or Kybella treatments. Kybella treatments. Um, so I've been talking a lot. I have so much editing to do. Literally, so much editing to do because I talk so much. I can't just be quiet so I can just skip so much but yeah get these now and if you do use like the for the double let me know because I don't know how to do that I'm done talking like comment subscribe if you have any questions just ask and I'll try to answer all right bye guys